Howdy, howdy. Say, this is Oregal. Welcome back. This is Tony Toxic, and we're playing Seven Days to Die. The last you left us, we were in a hub city, a ruined city in the wasteland, and we were surviving for our lives. <clears throat> yep, we're still in the hub city, getting our last day of looting out of the way. And once we're done here today, then we have to head back and uh, start building up our defenses again. Because we're going to have a day 14 horde. I just broke into a school, and one of the books in the school is the leather tanning book. Oh, sweet, sweet. I need that, actually. That yeah, makes me happy. Wait to stay overnight in the city to find that. Yeah, it was very much worth the wait. I'm going through a bookstore, and it looks like all I'm finding is plans we've had before, except I did find a uh, SMG schematic. <clears throat> Good deal. Nine mils, ten mils. You have to running through Ooh. apartments and businesses in this ruined city. Just found a lot of, uh, you know, scrap that we needed. You know, we need everything, but uh, we're only looking for, you know, we're looking for those books. Yeah, books are the best thing you can find in this game. There's a handlebar schematic in there. We already have that. Shotgun shell schematic and slug schematic. Oh, I didn't open the top part of that. Claw hammer schematic. I don't even remember finding that. But apparently wow. I already read one. So once we can get a forge going, then... You know, we'll be golden once we get a claw hammer and everything, because that's just going to be two hit upgrades. That's really going to speed everything up for upgrading, assuming we can get the materials we need to do it. It would be yeah, nice. I guess I should get that. Since I'm in a school, I found a Santa Claus hat. You guys probably noticed this video started a little bit into the day. Um, I actually looted the business, the business that I'm looking at right now, working stiff. Now I'm in another one, the big bookstore. Okay. And everything I found is back at home. So I had to empty my inventory if I was going to do anything. Oh, you went home? Yeah, I went home and I'm I'm back out of here. I had no idea. Yep, yep. I was stuck inside of apartment complex all night. And as you guys can see, I did spawn in a fire axe, so you don't have to sit here and watch me slap things for days to open them. These fire axes, for some reason, are am just amazing at breaking everything. And what's funny is, right after I spawned one in, I found a legitimate one, so I don't feel like I'm cheating anymore. <laughs> Even though I'm, I'm totally going to keep cheating to sustain this. <laughs> it's alright, this game's an alpha. I'm not going to feel bad about cheating on an alpha game. It sure it hurts the whole, uh, the point or the purpose of the game, I guess. But, I mean, it's, it's alpha. So... Not right. worried about it. Once the game is polished, then you can you can truly say that I would be going against the uh, I guess you would say the good sport of the game if I were to cheat after it's out of alpha. But right now it's fine. Like, what are you gonna do about it anyway, YouTubers? <laughs> Dislikes video instantly. <laughs> <laughs> Unfollow. Yeah, that. I actually got quite a few good, uh, good plans. I can build a sniper rifle too now. That's good. You know, oh, I probably right. accidentally broke the one bookshelf that had the forging book in it because I did accidentally break one as I started this recording. I clicked back on the app and I swung my axe. I didn't realize I was aiming right at a bookshelf and it would swing. And then that bookshelf didn't exist anymore. Oh, there's one more store up here. Man. 
You're a weird looking zombie the way you're standing. I'm not sure what you are. <clears throat> this is actually a police station because there's jail cells <clears throat> with dead bodies in it, so I feel bad for them. Now, I've noticed that whenever you kill a zombie in the city, they all kind of seem to know that a zombie died somewhere around. Somehow. Yeah, they, they have magical spider senses. I'm not sure why, but they do. Yeah, we're going to make sure nobody follows us up that ladder while we break in through the roof. Where are you? Okay, yeah, you're you're in a prison, right? Yep. So what store is this? Oh, we're good, man. Shamway Foods. You what? The Riddle of Steel. We just got the steel forging. That means we have oh, all. Oh yes. Sweet. We should be good to go then. Yeah. I'm gonna try to break in the roof back oh. here. Yeah, after I get out of this place, I'm going home. Yeah, after I finish looting here, I'm gonna head back to. I think this will probably be the last video for this game that I record today. I'm drink beer. Probably hop over. Yeah. I'll probably hop over, chill, play some Worlds of Tanks. I might actually record that too. And. Uh, Oh, cool. I might actually record some World of Tanks for you guys too while I uh, wind down. And I just picked up Pillars of Eternity, so I might check that out. I do have class in the morning, but anything to get a part of uh, the tubes and play with Michael? Oh, yeah. can't pass those up. You just can't pass up good pistol parts. Even though I picked up two pistol yeah. bombs. And he, you know what? I don't need that stone. I can get more stone. <sighs> Alright. Because science. Yeah, that. That's why we can carry like 700 pounds of shit. Because science. I'm actually going to drop this slug schematic because we're not going to need it. And we're not going to need the other SMG schematic because, I mean, I'm going to make one as soon as I get home. I think we have the parts. Sure, why not? I actually Hope picked up some rotten slugs. Oh, good. I picked up a few. Not many, but a few. Man, all of the bottles that I can just fill with water when we get home. I've been throwing down the bottles because there's so much nasty water being waiting to be churned. Yeah. I might actually start doing that soon. Is that a gas We've just station? got so much back at home. This is, this is nice, though, to just be able to take a couple of days and just loot. Find whatever you want, you know? Right. Okay, so I found a gas station. I'm not just going to pass up these gas barrels, so... Yeah, best not to. Wrong. You can also loot the actual gas pumps, too. Pick yourself up lots and lots of gas. So here's the thing. You see, you find bullet casings. You don't really need them, because once you get the, uh, the bullet casing mold, you can make as many as you want. And you have plenty yeah. of... Right. Audio should be fixed now. Yeah.
Wow, someone was surviving in here. There's a fireplace, punji sticks, yeah. This is an interesting little place to go. I wonder if that's new. I want to say there was a tiny update to this not long ago. Is it actually in this hub city? Yes. Yeah, it's definitely not for me then, because this is my first time in the hub city. I haven't even laid any spikes. Actually, I don't even have any spikes in my inventory to lay out out here. Yeah, it was just it was just one little one little spike that was in the doorway that was collapsed. It was really interesting. stores are all on the outskirts, man. Okay. Yeah, the stores all seem to be on the outside edges. I hear some zombies going crazy trying to get to me. Oh, there's a cop. Run, run, run. There's a shovel. I don't want to pick it up. Sorry. What is this? What is this? Man, a this is about the worst grocery store I've ever seen. Shamway Foods. Are you in here? Yeah, I, I actually just finished looting in here. Oh yeah, you're in here, okay. So, yeah. I'm thing because there's a, uh, a big nasty, there's a scrap cable. Oh, can't get you some yeah, I'm running out of here too. Um, I was saying something a moment ago. He's right here. Oh no, you stupid dog. Go away. In one of those stores, did you put up some uh, blocks? Wooden blocks? Yep. Man, I can't jump up and lay blocks under myself. I'm gonna have to just beat my way out of here. Some help. I just got a dog on me. I think I'll be okay though. Alright. It's already 1700. Yeah, after I get done in here, I gotta, I gotta get out of this place. Die, dog. Why is there a zombie on the roof? Because science. Yeah, because science or something. All right. Um, I'm just gonna run back. As fast as I can, I'm going to try to run back. Alright, I already looted that store and this uh, Born and Noble. Hey, here you go. Pick this up. I can't. I have no room. Okay. But I got plenty of books and schematics for you to read when we get back, so... Yeah, I got some too. I trashed the ones that we're only going to need one copy of because there's only going to be one of us using them. I kept the ones that you'll be probably using more than I will, the forging related ones and like claw hammer, shotgun schematics, SMG schematics and stuff. And I'm gonna give you everything that I thought was pertinent because this is your world. And that's what friends do. Yep. So my strategy is I don't take the road back home, I just skirt right across the map to find my home. 
Yep. That's what I'm going to be doing. I thought you were behind me, but you were not, so I'm going to keep going. I actually am just like right behind you. Pass some charcoal there, but screw that. Yeah. No room to pick up charcoal right now, so. Feathers, yay. Yeah, it's going to be time to try to craft a gun or two when we get back. I have three pistols on me. <laughs> nice. I found one that was brown, but I knew you already had one, so I just scrapped it because I wanted room for other stuff. I've got yeah. one that's yellow. I didn't realize you went back to, uh, to the base. I uh, I got a pretty good find from an overnight excursion. Only reason I went back to the base was because I found so many gun parts and it was just eating my inventory so fast. Yeah, the only gun parts I kept were really good ones. Yeah, exactly. I, I only kept like yellow and green and blue. There's like one orange, I think, maybe back at home, maybe two. I got rid of our old uh, hunting rifle parts because I found a much better one. Man, this is way out here, isn't it? Yeah, we went pretty far. Alright, so the next couple of days, like tonight we're just going to be doing inventory management and then the next couple of days we'll just be preparing the base and ourselves. Yeah. Oop, uh, coffee time. We did we exactly what we wanted to do. We found a city looted didn't even loot the whole city yeah we barely really did much but we got most of the businesses I think at least at least half the businesses by the judging by the With, size of the town well, I'm they pretty I'm pretty sure that they all spawned on that side probably nice I didn't realize there were this many golden rods that spawn on clay You and your goldenrod. I love goldenrod tea, man. That stuff is awesome. Okay. And luckily we were far enough away from our house that no more destruction would have come to it. Okay. So I thought I was following you, I wasn't looking at your arrow, and I was actually following a zombie. I always just run after the home symbol. I don't know what I was doing. I was derping it up, man. Oh, look, I see home. You know, that grocery store was the worst grocery store ever. Was it? It only had one type of food in the entire grocery store. I have 62 cans of sham. Ah, <laughs> uh, sham. The canned ham that you just can't slam. Yeah, that. Because it tastes like shit, you can't just wolf it down. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this stuff tastes heinous. Heinous anus. Yes, that. I was going to make an anus joke. I was really thinking hard about it. You know, when I right-click to scrap on something, I really don't want to open my inventory every single time that I do that ever. No. I know, right? Uh -huh. Called that out in my last video. I was, like, super annoying. <laughs> but, you know, it is what it is. It's an alpha game. I can't expect it to be perfect. Stick this honey in there. Honey's awesome. Two hundred and six scrap iron. Let me throw in my hundred and 
three. Wow, we got lots of scrap iron to build up the base with. That's awesome. Yes. Um, it's time to build another chest. Yep. I'm going to move our, uh, water and bottle crap all over to one. Actually, saving the animal hide for whenever we uh, get the bellows. Nice. And I, the one closest to my sleeping bag is where I'm putting all the schematics I found. Read them. Enjoy them. <laughs> Where do we want beakers? I put them with the health. Okay. I didn't realize it, but I have like eight beakers. Got plenty of ammo for whenever I finally get a sniper rifle. Oh, let me unlock that. I totally forgot. Yeah, there we go. Bottles. I love the Santa hat, by the way. I just noticed that. Oh, thanks. I haven't been able to look at it. It's better than what I had. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna pull our bullet crafting stuff out and our arrow stuff. Yeah. Throw all that in a different chest too. Yeah, I had a bunch of good little gun parts drops and lots of ammo. Lots of ammo. So with the remainder of the video, I'm going to place some more wooden log spikes. Cool. Hey, you found a shotgun shell schematic too, so I'll scrap both of them. Okay, delete that one. Definitely want that. I'm gonna scrap one of these brown pistols because I really don't see us needing both. Oh, it's time for the running. The running of the zombies. Yeah, I definitely want to make a new chest for the uh, bullets. Oh, I should be able to make a forge, so once we get some clay and all that stuff. Yeah, we've got a bellows. All we needed to do was pick up one thing of clay on our way back in the house, but we didn't think about it. Uh -oh. Well, the next time you have plenty of scrap iron to improve all of these wooden log spikes. Maybe not all of them, but... This is going to be the bullet crafting one, so that's going to get bullet casing shells. Our actual extra ammo is going to go in here too. Okay. Actually, I don't think I'm going to need that, but I'm going to keep it with me just in case. Okay. Arrows. I don't need my steel arrows or arrowheads. Okay, that's good for now. You should probably have a forge by then. All right, let's look at what kind of guns we might be able to make. Uh, 
Oh, those solid slugs need to go into the bullet chest in a moment, too. Can I craft an SMG yet? There's the receiver. The stock. I'm just Parts. outside. I'm getting spikes. Alright. Careful. I think I heard a screamer just a second ago. Okay, I'm missing the SMG barrel. I think I'm missing parts. Yeah, I'm missing sniper rifle parts. Okay. What do you prefer, the shotgun or the sawed-off shotgun? Um, I've only ever used sawed-off. Okay. I think the shotgun might be slightly better with the parts that I have, so we'll craft that. Did I have this? Okay, no, I don't have this stuff to make a sawed-off too, so. Well, let's go throw the parts back in here. Alright, cool. Now, actual miscellaneous stuff's gonna just go in there too. Fuck it. Now, repair kits. I just throw the shotgun in there, I think I did. Yeah, I did. Okay. Repair. And that took five kits. Mm, shotgun's not too bad. So do you want the shotgun or do you want a different weapon? I can hold, I mean, I, it doesn't matter. Okay. I'm going with my pistol. Alright. What color is your pistol? Brown. Okay. Uh, if that's the case, then I will leave you my yellow pistol in the ammo chest. Okay. Since I'm keeping the shotgun, I'll give you that. That was day 11. Day 11, alright. Well, it's time to cut this video off, I believe. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. We'll see you in the we'll next video.